What's up, YouTube? Kainu back here again for another video. Today, I'm going to be showing you how to stream live to Facebook with OBS. But without further ado, let's get into it. All right, let's get into it. So the first thing I'm going to do is go over to your Facebook page. So now that we're over on our Facebook page, we're going to go ahead and head into Creator Studio. So click on Creator Studio. Once you're inside of Creator Studio, there's gonna be a go live button in the top middle of the screen. You're gonna go ahead and click on that. Once that opens up, you're gonna see two options, go live or create a live video event. I'm gonna choose go live. And then since I'm making a test broadcast pretty much for this video, I'm gonna go ahead and click this little check mark right here. But for you in your instance, I would just recommend leaving this blank and then clicking on select. All right, once you click select, it's actually going to load you into your live dashboard and this is where you're going to be able to connect it to OBS. So you see webcam right here and then streaming software. We're going to click on streaming software and this is going to give us a stream key. Okay. You're going to go ahead and copy that stream key and then we're going to head over to OBS. So I'm going to pull OBS up and I'm going to show you where to put that actual stream key. Okay. Now we are over on OBS. As you can see, I have a test stream up on screen. But what I'm going to do is come down to settings right here in the bottom right. And then I'm going to go to stream. And then for service, you're going to pick on Facebook Live. So you see a few options and then Facebook Live. Go ahead and click that. And then you're going to put your stream key that you got from your Facebook dashboard in right here. You're going to go ahead and paste it in and then click on apply and click OK. So this has just connected your OBS to your actual Facebook live stream. But we're gonna hop back on over to Facebook and take it from there. Okay, now we are back on my Facebook page and they make you actually put a title and a description for your live stream. So I'm just gonna put in test stream right here. You can put in whatever you want, a stream and then a description and then click on save. And then you can also add a thumbnail to your actual live stream. I'm not gonna do that in this instance, but once you do that, you're going to hop back over to OBS. So let's go ahead and go back to OBS and click on start streaming. Okay, we are back on OBS and all you have to do now is click on start streaming. All right, so we clicked on start streaming. And as you can see in the bottom right, there's drop frames, live time, CPU usage, your FPS, and then your bit rate. Okay, so that means that we're live streaming to Facebook, but we are not actually live at the moment. We're just streaming to our Facebook dashboard, but we haven't actually posted it onto our page. So let's go ahead and hop back onto our Facebook page and I'll show you what to do next. Okay, we are back on our Facebook page. And as you can see, test stream from my OBS is actually on my Facebook dashboard. And as you can see down here in the bottom left, it'll say go live for you guys. For me, it says start test. But what I'm going to do is I'm going to click on start test right here. And this is going to start your live stream and it's actually going to post it to your page. So this is actually how you start your live stream and it's posted on your page. Now you can see all of the analytics right here, your bit rate, your frame rate, your audio bit rate. And then you can see all of the insights as well. Viewers, reactions, clips, shares, comments, and then every comment that someone leaves on your live stream that's on your page will appear here as well. And then you can block your keywords. You can ban people from your stream. You can suspend people from your stream and then you can put on profanity filters. And then there's a ton of other options you can do, but this is how you stream from OBS to Facebook. If you have any questions, drop them down in the comment section. I'll leave links to everything in the description and then make sure you like and you subscribe and don't forget to take it easy.